Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Mena and today we are speaking about your teeth health. So as you see, I look a bit different. I have a very big cheek right here. Yesterday I had root resection surgery. I just want to share my experience and how I feel about that. First of all, let's start from the story and why I had to go through this. When I was about 12 or 13, I had problems with my 46 tooth. I had an infection under my roots. When you have infection under tooth, it's very dangerous and you just have to do a root canal. I did that and it didn't help and the cysts, the infection was not going away and I just, you know, was living with that, hoping that it will disappear. And when I was about 17 or 18, I think, I went to the doctor again and she told me like, it's not healing and we can just try rerouting again. I just told, okay, never mind, let's do that. And they have rerouted my whole tooth, all my four canals. And we were hoping that the cysts were disappear again. When I was 25 or 26, I started to feel pain in that area again. And I went to another doctor and she told me, yeah, there is infection, cysts are not disappearing, so what are we going to do? And I was very stubborn, I wanted to save my tooth so badly because, I don't know, I just love my teeth. Three years ago, I decided to reroute it again for the second time. So, in total, I had three root canals of this tooth. And this year, I've decided that I am done with it and that I am going to have a surgery. That's a bit scary because, you know, you have to drill your jaw you have to drill your bone. I was totally afraid, I was totally scared of this, but I've decided that it's enough of waiting, it's enough of suffering. You know, 15 years of having an infection doesn't sound right. There were some years when it didn't hurt at all, when I didn't feel any discomfort, so I was just going with that, hoping for the best and hoping them to disappear, but it did not. So the operation looks like this. They cut your gums around that tooth and they take a bit bigger space. Uh, after that, they pull this gums away and they drill the hole in the jawbone just to reach the roots. And then with a the small special instruments, they just take out all the infection and then they cut the tips of the root. Now let's talk about my experience yesterday. I was shitting in my pants. I was really scared of this because I'm not actually scared of doctors and I trust them, but I'm just a very sensitive person and I just can be very anxious and overwhelmed by everything what I'm experiencing, by smells, by sounds, by visionary elements. You know, I just, sometimes I can get really very paranoid or, or anxious and have a panic attack. That's why I'm meditating a lot and doing other stuff and trying, you know, mindfulness, etc. But sometimes it doesn't work. So yesterday when I just came into the doctor's cabinet and sat on the table, I already felt my heart rate. I was just laying and, and calming myself down. That everything will be fine. I got the anesthesia and everything is fine. I'm relaxed because I don't feel anything. The surgery is starting and I feel that something's going on and I start to feel blood in my mouth. Everything is fine until she says, okay, so can you give me that drill? And then I, I started to feel like I'm, I'm a bit panicking, but I was fine. I was still very, you know, mindful and I was repeating in my head that everything is okay, then that's normal, that they're professional, that, you know, and I'm just, you know, calming myself down and she's drilling and I hear the drill and then she says, okay, now we will remove the infection. Then she starts to remove and something goes wrong and she's like, okay, no, I have to drill more. And I'm like, why? I don't want to have a big hole, you know, in my jaw. And then I started to be very scared that something is not going well. You know that feeling when you're going to faint, your hearing get worse, then your sight like almost disappears. I am feeling like it's so hot and I'm starting to sweat and my surgeon says, 
hey, how do you feel, you know? And I'm just lying. I'm showing her like, uh. <laughs> and she understood immediately that, you know, I'm going to find. <laughs> she stood up like, okay, everything is fine. Don't panic. Everything is okay. So they laid me down so that the blood can reach my brain. They opened the window and she told me just to hold my hands like this, not to pass out, just to move my fingers. So I'm laying like this, <laughs> you know, doing this stuff. And another surgeon comes in and he's like, what's going on here, you know? <laughs> and I feel so embarrassed. And my surgeon says like, we are doing root resection and he says really and i felt like oh my god i felt super embarrassed but uh, you know i accept myself as i am and i understand that some people are super sensitive it's okay you know some people are really afraid of dentists or or of blood or of smell of blood or taste of blood or just drilling a bone coming back to myself they continued the surgery and i was fine and she told like don't worry it's almost almost done and she starts cleaning again and she says okay i still have to drill a bit more but this time i was like okay fuck it just finish it i want to get out of this like as soon as i can oh my god it starts to hurt when i really laugh a lot Ooh, no. She says like, okay, it's almost done. And she starts to cut the tips and remove everything. And then I smell such a disgusting smell. It felt like I didn't wash my, my teeth for, I don't know, 100 years. So <laughs> she put the stitches, everything was finished. I just want to mention that when I left a clinic, I was so damn happy. I wanted to cry from happiness because I felt so relieved that finally after 15 years of having this infection I was brave enough to do a surgery. I just feel so amazing. I hope that my health will improve. I hope that all my pain that I had on this neck side, I hope this will disappear because I think that it was just because of that infection. Anyway, I'm glad I'm alive, very happy about my choice. If you have this problem, if you're thinking about this, I definitely, definitely recommend the surgery. You don't have to get rid of your tooth if it's healthy on the outside. Just remove everything from the inside and you'll be fine. So that's it for today, guys. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Please subscribe and share with your friends. Stay healthy. Bye.